The whole of Caltire Place is going to be turned into one big, massive stage. Plans are underway to fill the stands for the second annual Okanagan Military Tattoo. It's a, basically a big marching, singing, dancing, music extravaganza. It's a variety show with lots of culture and a rich history. The history of the tattoo basically goes back 300 years when the British Army were in Belgium. It's probably the Hundred Years' War. Drummers would go through the main streets, signaling troops to return to their barracks. And at the same time, the drummers were yelling out, Do dem tap toe, which means turned off the taps too. And this thing got shortened down to tattoo. In Canada, the Nova Scotia tattoo uh, is in its 38th year. We're just in our second year, so we're, we have a little bit of catching up to do, but we've got lots of good models to follow. We will have 500 performers in the show, and uh, of the 500 performers, there will be nearly 100 pipes and drums, there will be 100 brass and reeds with the military bands. Basically, it's made up of the military, non-military, RCMP are part of it, the first responders are part of it. It's also a chance to see different cultures coming together. The young dance groups in town, the Highland dancers, the Punjabi dancers, the Ukrainian dancers. There's a hundred voice choir. It really is a very exciting show, a lot of emotion, as you can imagine, with a uh, hundred pipes and drums when they come in, you know, playing certain songs that people know. It, it really is, a, it becomes very emotional. The show really appeals to everybody, mums, dads, grandpas, grandmas, children. Uh, it's a show for everybody because we have young performers all the way up to very seasoned performers. But tickets are expected to go fast. Last year was a phenomenal turnout. We have 2,500 seats that are available to us here at the Cal Tire Place and we were almost sold out for both shows. The Okanagan Military Tattoo 2015 is an event that you don't want to miss. Our, our success last year and the word out in the valley is that this is something that everybody wants to go to. For Go Okanagan, I'm Jamie Ross.